three point shooting niya. Madami kami kikitain niya pag meron kami kanyang three point shooting. Here's Doss. Simpson. There's just so much confidence in the moves, in the body language of the Aces here in the opening quarter. And they're on top 27-16 here in the first period. Back with more opening quarter action. Uh, let's go back to Cheska. Uh, you guys mentioned earlier that Mac Macardona is not here today. That's because he got married. He married his longtime girlfriend, Carissa Francisco. And some people are asking, how does this affect the game of talk and text? Well, you know what Coach Chot said? The challenge isn't Mac's absence. It's getting back to playing in a high level. The way they played the game last time, they couldn't finish plays that they could usually finish. Um, they couldn't make their shots. They couldn't take over situations where they usually take control. So Coach Chot says, you know, they need to get their act together and start playing playoff basketball. Nico and Andy? Well, that's true, you know. Uh, you just have to have, uh, you improvise with what you have. What I was looking at that play very well, devised by the uh, talking te text uh, game for us. And this is very important. People may not realize that, but Simpson picked up his second foul. If Simpson gets into foul trouble and has to sit down, that's going to be a big advantage for the top on Texas. All right. As of the moment, uh, Lamang po ng G's Punto sa Alaska. 27-17 in the opening quarter. Baguio has the ball and the bands. The Vance, ball is back with him, he fires away, and what a scorching opening quarter for JDV with 14 points. And he's 5 out of 5 from the field, so why did he get 14 points? Because 4 of them was, uh, those are 3 points yet. Kelly Williams now in the ball game, and here's Alapag to Kelly, back to Alapag. Lots of time to shoot for talking text, but they're down by 12 points. Here's Kelly Williams, he fires a three high looper. Good, good one. And that, that augurs well for their team. Because that's all he had the other day. He had three points. He has three points right now with his first attempt. Kelly Williams, uh, Jimmy Lapak, Cardona, Ryan Reyes all did not shoot well in that first game. Here's Tenorio getting away. Rebound Kelly Williams. Rocket X down by nine. Ryan Reyes bounce pass. Harvey Carey will score. Well, a good run here by the uh, Propan Texters. They have cut down that lead to only seven. Remember, like I said, when Simpson pick up the second foul, he's not going to be able to challenge a lot of shots that are going to the hoop right now. But that Alaska lead is down to seven points, 29-22. Baguio. And that's going to be a turnover on Baguio. And one of the heroes of game one, Reyna Lugnatan, is in the game, replacing Sadi Toss. Under three minutes to go in the first period, Kelly Williams against the Vats. Whoa, a blow by! Uh, five points already for Kelly Williams. That's one thing that the Vans really has to improve on, is his defense, you know, for a guy to blow by, and he was about six feet away from you, you should be able to catch up with him at that stage. Another steal here. Harvey Carey. And there's Kelly Williams. And there's Ryan Reyes. And don't look now, but it's just a three-point game. Eight of that lead so fast. That was a 12-point lead just moments ago. So we enter a 30-second timeout brought to you by Handy Fix of First Aid ng Bahay Mo, Bonds off, and Seals off. Well, you know, it started with a three-point shot of Kelly Williams. And then a lot of turnovers on the part of Alaska, plus the missed layup of L.A. Tinorio. Then, uh, Token Tex, upping up the speed. You know, they got players coming off the bench, they up the up their uh, momentum, their tempo, and they were able to get much better shots than they had been getting in the first few minutes of the game. And Haynes is the official underwear of the PBA. One minute and 57 remaining in the opening quarter. The coach is still going with their imports, not giving them any rest. They played 10 straight minutes and hard basketball at that. Joe Devance now being marked here by Harvey Carey for good reason. <laughs> Here's Baggio. That's a great matchup, by the way. Baggio against Ryan Reyes. 
three-pointer can tie this game, but Kelly Williams says, I'll scoot in, but I but he missed the layup. Rebound para kay Huglata. Here's Baggio in the open court. Tenorio, Devance, Devance fires. Not this time, you can see it was way offline. But Diamond Simpson got the offensive rebound. Okay, Kelly Williams is Kelly Williams at the his first personal. You'll see the first appearance of Tony De La Cruz and Joe DeVance. Great shooting performance here in the first period. Well, Tim Cohn was writing him for all that he could get from him. When he missed, okay, I'll take you out. <laughs> you might be tired. Yeah. Oh, you must be tired. He, he, yes, he is yeah. tired. <laughs> So once again, pocket text, knocking on the door, down by just three points. Alapag, Ryan Reyes. Oh, great suspension in mid-air. So what a big comeback here for the Propan Texters. They're just down by one. Momentum is on their side. Both teams are not in the penalty, so they have fouls to give. One-point game para sa Alaska. That was once a 12-point lead. But the throw up on Texters battling back. But under a minute to play in the first. Here's De La Cruz. It's normally money in the bank, but he missed it. And here's Alapag. Alapag. Reyes. Reyes. Back to Alapag. Under 30 seconds remaining in the opening quarter. And the throw up on Texters can actually grab the lead on this play. And now uh, Alaska can go for the last shot, but the Texters have fouls to give. They have two fouls to give, actually. And they will use that. Seven seconds remaining in the first quarter. There's one. Jimmy knew it. He was just waiting for him to make the move. They still have one. And the Jet, Jeffrey Carriasso, checks in the ball game for the first time para sa Alaska. And you have these players coming into the table, including Lau. Give up fouls if you have to, you know. Five seconds to go. Three seconds to go. And the Jet goes in. No longer the Jet of old. That would have been two points in, in the old time. Aja magtatapos ang opening quarter. With Alaska holding on to a one-point lead, 29-28. Join the PBA run for a cause. For more details, just call the PBA hotline 470-276-8269. Local 211 or 117. I have a suspicion that Seb is excited for the fun game. <laughs> <laughs> you think, huh? Hula, hula, hula. Uh, hula. Maybe, it's, maybe. Wild, it's a wild hunch. Pero salita ay dyan, it's uh, happening July 31. PBA runs for a cause. Meantime, it's Simulana on second period, and Reyna Lugnatan operates against Rana Del Del Campo. That's the Aces. That's how the Aces start the second quarter. Well, he's continuing where he left off in game number one. At the low post, where he's so effective. He let him go to the left, and holding foul this time called against Jeff Carriasso. Well, in that opening quarter, Alaska actually led by as many as 12 points, riding the red-hot shooting of Joe DeVance in that opening quarter, but then talking text, bringing in Ryan Reyes and Kelly Williams off the bench. They battled back and whittled down that uh, deficit to just uh, one point. So second personal, para kay Carriasso, picking up two consecutive fouls here. Alaska po ang lamang sa best of seven series, 1-0. Great shot there by Ryan Reyes. Instead of driving against him, this time he elected to take an outside shot and still made it. Look at the way they trap. Uh, oh, that's a nice move there by uh, Diamond Simpson hanging in midair. Almost exactly like the shot that Ugnatan hit earlier. But talk and text. You like their defense. They're challenging those guys penetrating.